Hello everyone, I am Jun Chan. Welcome back to the stream. Um, today we are back on uh, Haskell things um, and specifically going back to uh, our N body uh, simulation or really what is our excuse to try and get um, to work on Haskell in the GPU. And uh, quite a bit of um, quite a bit of changes from last time since we're now on uh, NixOS. I think we finally got a fairly stable uh, situation on NixOS. It's not, it's not, it's far from perfect, but it's, I think, more or less, <laughs> more or less stable. I actually had a crush uh, just before, uh, just before starting today. Uh, also, the sound is not, uh, is not the best. That's because I have, not set up my uh, my good microphone yet here, uh, but uh, we'll get there. And um, another thing about uh, the Tuesday stream is that I want to start um, basically making all the different stream converge. And one of the uh, things that we're doing now on Saturdays is also working with Haskell. Um, more with uh, this framework of uh, GStreamer and uh, in the context directly of streaming. Um, on, on Thursday, we're working more on the browser side of things, so connecting to the streaming by aiming to work on a stream overlay or maybe something like a streamer overlay. And um, here on Tuesday, I want to continue, I want to pick up where we sort of drop the ball in terms of uh, what we're doing on the, on, the, on my Windows install and uh, try to at least get the, to run the end body example in the GPU, maybe uh, work on um, implementing the, the, um, the more sophisticated uh, end body algorithm um, that we found. And once we've got a little bit of our uh, our bearings there, then I think I want to start moving into uh, maybe generating graphics through uh, through Haskell. And so uh, that's probably not for today, but um, let's uh, do a little bit of uh, housekeeping there. And we are, uh, what day today? 23rd. So let's create the lock for today. And uh, we are so we're moving back, not on the NixOS stream, but the nBody stream. So that's good news. And right, the name uh, is the balance header algorithm. But we probably have to, we didn't switch to Ubuntu in the end, we switched to, uh, to NixOS. Um, but, um, but the spirit is the same. We have switched, and um, so it seems that everything that's sort of more Windows-like, uh, we will drop at least for the foreseeable future. And um, what we want is at least run the end body example. So probably a bit of uh, tooling still, um, but hopefully things will be a little bit faster than. Um, and it is slightly more straightforward than with um, Windows. But we shall see. So um, let's see, where are we here? Um, we have a shared workshop and body uh, accelerate example. And uh, if we, what, if we can build this, then what happens? We don't have GC yet, so, well, I suppose we could stack. Yeah, stack build, that, that would be the best way, but we don't have stack, but that's fine. Should be done easily through Nixemf. And um, we are not 
going to, I think, Nixify our, the Haskell build quite yet, because that will be another bit of a rabbit hole. Um, but in any case, we are going to have to uh, take a look at the code, which is right there. Um, oh, I did have a default.next here. So, and we are using stuff coming from the cache, at least for GHC 8. So that's our main uh, stack out 16. Oh, yeah, that's right. And I think we did start building. Um, so we shall see where uh, up to where we we got. Um, right, the, we did we did need to uh, update the CUDA package as well. Oh yeah, right. We're we're going to need to install CUDA. That's going to be uh, that's going to be a bit of a next thing, I suppose. Um, so let's see. And uh, how could we do this? Install tabs. That is not what I want to do. I want to actually minimize this. How do I do that? Hmm. Not sure. And I also don't want this. So let's move this here. And let's get ourselves a fresh Firefox window. That is not a Firefox window. Oh, I seem to have uh, exited Firefox for some reason. Um, yeah. And a new window. Okay. So, um, CUDA on NixOS. <laughs> okay, what's this? Essentially, config parts you need to ask to etc nexus configuration that next in order to have CUDA. Particularly, in the system D unit creates a dev NVIDIA 0 and 1 and CTR files. Okay, well, maybe we we'll want to take a look at this. Uh, what's happening there? It doesn't look quite right it's a bit strange but okay um okay system packages video driver for x server we i don't think we ended up using that uh, let's see, let's get another terminal window. Um, X server enabled true. No, we did not. We ended up using mode setting. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure whether we're going to need to uh, use that, but if you make and GCC and CUDA toolkit, that sounds like that's going to be needed. So let's. Uh... All right. Oh, that's a bit of an issue. Yeah. Since I installed Node Home Manager, 
um, I might not even be able to I, I get myself out of that because I don't have a uh, I don't have a root password, right? Um, Oh boy, that is going to be a little bit tricky. So more next things. I'm afraid this is unavoidable. XOS Home Manager and Sudoers file. Security sudo config file. Right, but I can't, I, I don't see how I'm going to be able to do this since I don't have root access. Have I locked myself out? This file only have read access for non root. So I think I have locked myself out. And here it fell on open GL row. Library file does not exist. A system package, a GL, right. Just need to have a GL implementation. Okay, so uh, we can see how to install this. On Nixos, uh, missing C library, libgl, right? So Nixos libgl. I mean, this is obviously moot if I can't uh, connect to, if I can't uh, even edit my Etsy Nexus configuration dot X. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to have to reboot and uh, solve this in uh, at the, in the boot sequence. Uh, let's just make sure that I know what I'm going to do. Um,
So we're adding OSR to the real group, uh, NixOS configuration users. Let's see how what I use to um, configure the user here. I did users dot users. Oh, maybe that's the problem. Is I, I said that it was a normal user. Extra group. Extra groups equal wheel. Okay, I'll see you in a bit.